everyone and welcome to this legs and ab burner. So what we're going to do is we're going to set a lower body move, um, plyometric lower body move with an ab move. So we're going to do the lower body move 26 seconds, a weird number I know. <laughs> so it'll be 26 seconds, 8 second transition and then 26 seconds on the ab move as well. So we're just going to keep going through that. We're going to go for five or six rounds um, depending how long this video starts to get. <laughs> Probably six. So we'll see. Uh, I hope you can hear me over the little bit of wind we have today, but it's amazing outside, so I had to try and film it outside. Um, so I'm going to show you all the moves first, and then we're just going to go ahead and get started. So the first thing that we're going to do um, is a drop lunge. So you're going to have your feet together, and you're going to kind of hop up and split your legs and drop down into a lunge. So it's going to look like this. You're going to hop up and split into a lunge, just like this. So together and split, just like that. So, and what we're gonna pair that with is scissors. So legs are gonna be straight up, one goes down, and then we're gonna switch, hold for a beat, switch, switch, just like that. So your quads are gonna start to burn during that too. <laughs> um, the next thing we're gonna do is an in and out squat. So we're gonna start with a chair squat, hop up to a regular squat, up to a chair squat, up to a regular squat, just like that. Um, and what we will do with it is a legs up twist. So legs are going to be up, and you're going to reach the opposite side of your foot. So opposite, outside of the foot, a little bit crunch off the ground. Make sure you're not straining your neck forward when you're doing this. You want to kind of keep it neutral to the sky. And then the last two that we're going to do are going to be a sumo jack. So sumo squat position, toes out, knees go out where the toes are pointing. So you're going to have wide stance, weight is still in your heels, sit back and down, jump together, back and down, jump together. So just like this. That'll be your sumo jack and we're going to do a double dead bug with it. So we're going to lie on our back. Knees are at 90, heels are going to tap the ground. When I lay down, the sun gets nice and in my eyes. <laughs> so, one heel tap, two heel tap, both heel tap. So, when you're doing this, you want to keep your back from arching off the mat. So, if you need to, put your hands kind of right below your butt. But the move's going to look the same other than that. Um, if not, just do it regular. So, you want to try and keep your knees from moving. Uh, or changing angles, all the angle change is coming from your hips. So those are our six moves. If you need to go back and watch them, uh, go ahead and go back and watch them again. Otherwise, we're just going to go ahead and get started. I have my timer and, you know, a list of the moves in case during my exhaustion <laughs> I forget what's next. So we're going to go ahead and start. We've got 18 rounds until we're finished. It's an 18-minute workout, so it's going to be great awesome fun so let's go ahead and get started and the first thing was that drop lunge all right so let's turn my volume up a tiny bit all right and i'm gonna actually face this way so drop and together so just like that nice and quick nice and low in your lunge but not so low that your knee hits the ground <laughs> you never want your knee hitting the ground that's painful and also bad for your knee. And we have three seconds left here. We're almost done. And we are going to transition into those scissors. And it's time to scissor. So just a beat and then switch. And here again, no arching your lower back. I can hear my timer ticking now. I need to turn up the volume. <laughs> All right, so switch. You can kind of go at your own pace. You just want to have a little beat before you switch. And all right, now we're gonna hop right back up and go into those in and out squats. Oh, that's not the right move. <laughs> so in and out squats, right here. In and out. So just like this. And we're already almost done here. And three, oh no, 
a little bit longer. <laughs> and one. All right. So I was wrong here. We have a four second transition. <laughs> so we're going to do those leg switches. <laughs> so leg nice and straight. And you are just switching in and out. Or <laughs> switching side to side, not in and out. I was thinking of the in and out squats. Only a few more seconds here. And we're going up to sumo jacks. And squat together. Beautiful sumo jacks. <laughs> Who doesn't love these? Make your inner thighs and all around your thighs burn. And after this, we're doing that double dead bug. So that'll be fabulous. And three, two, and switch. All right, so we start that double dead bug now. Tap and double tap. So tap, tap, and double tap. <laughs> Beautiful lower ab move. Really make sure your lower or your lower back doesn't come off the mat. Try and move my timer to where I can see it better. <laughs> and all right, we're up. And we are starting those drop lunges now. So drop and together. And we're already done <laughs> with round one. Our only breaks in this little workout <laughs> are going to be those four second transitions. So it's a great workout. <laughs> Just keep going and going and going. And we're gonna switch. And there we go, down for the scissors. Slip the legs up and scissor. Beautiful scissors. <laughs> Just hold for a beat and switch. And keep that lower back from arching. And just keep on keeping on. Let's see what time we get here. We got about four seconds left. And then we're going into in and out squats. And here we go. In and out squats now. So in and out. When you're squatting, that weight is in your heels. And then you roll up onto the toes to pop into the air and switch squats. <laughs> Great little moves. Lovely lower body burn and they get your heart rate up. We got five more seconds left of this one. And a two and done. All right, so we're doing that legs up twist. I can feel my hair going everywhere. <laughs> and go. So legs up and twist. Keep that neck neutral. Don't let it start to crane towards your knees. You never want that. I'm gonna crane it real quick. All right, a few more seconds. And switch. So we're going up for those sumo jacks. And go. <laughs> together and squat together. Lovely sumo jacks. <laughs> As soon as I start doing them, I start feeling them. That's great. <laughs> All right, so just keep on squatting and hopping those feet together. Almost done here. And then we're into those double dead bugs. And here we go. Double dead bugs. And start. And double. Anyone else think I should have made the uh, transition longer here. <laughs> I could have used an extra second or two between moves. <laughs> if you do this again alone, feel free to, you know, even give yourself six seconds between moves. All right, and we're up for those drop lunges. And go. My quads are burning. I don't know about you. <laughs> it's a lovely feeling. But we're already on round three. Yay! So keep on hopping, lunging, and squatting. And working those abs for just a few more minutes. 
and two, and we're going into scissors. Leg straight up, and go. So switch, just for a beat, and then switch again. Lovely scissors. <laughs> really focus on engaging your abs here, pulling your belly button to your spine. We've only got six more seconds, and then we're going into in and out squats. So now we're headed up, and we are starting in and out squats now. So squatting in and squatting out <laughs> and hopping back and forth, adding hops to all of these movements really does a good job getting your heart rate going, making you work harder. Five more seconds here, make your quads burn even more and done. All right, so legs up, twist, Whew. legs up. And let's start twisting. And just twist as close to touching your foot as you can. If you feel your neck start to hurt, <laughs> check in and make sure you're not craning it forward. We're almost done here. About four more seconds. And up. All right. We are back to sumo jacks now. Down and together. <laughs> oh boy. Should have done four rounds of this, right? <laughs> but this is the end of round three. So we're almost done. We're halfway if we do six, a little more if we do five, and two, and up, and double dead bug time. So legs at 90 and go. Heel taps. Lovely heel taps. I'm hoping my quads can make it through. <laughs> Three more rounds of those lower body moves. I'm sure they can. <laughs> it's whether I want to. And I do, I do. I know you do too. And up. We are going to drop lunges. So hop together and then hop up and drop into a lunge. You want the weight in the balls to the heel of that back foot until you're hopping up. Then you press through your toe. Have four more seconds here. And scissor time. So back on the ground, legs up, and scissors. And switch, and switch, and switch. <laughs> really engage your core, pull that belly button in. Keep everything nice and tight. And switch those feet. We're almost done here. Six more seconds, kinda almost done. <laughs> and then we are going for right now into in and out squats, so let's go. Gotta love plyometric movements <laughs> and short rests. Whoop, I'm hopping off my mat. So, if you're wondering why I'm even hopping on a mat, <laughs> it's because I'm doing this on cement, which isn't the most friendly for hopping. And last one, whew, and we're going to Legs up, twist. So cement's not the best thing. And go to hop on. So I try to give myself a little <laughs> cushion by hopping on the yoga mat. Hopefully it helps. Oh, my quads are burning. <laughs> Just holding this position. I hope yours are too. And almost done. Five more seconds. And then we're going to sumo jacks. And up. So it's sumo jack time, right now. Oh, yay. So just nice squats. If you need to slow your pace down, which is fine, but it's better to slow down a little bit than stop completely. Though if you do need a tiny rest, 
it is okay. Eventually you won't. All right, so down for a double dead bugs and go. So really engage your core. Really try and keep those knees at 90 and keep your back on the mat. You'll feel a lot more in your lower abs if you keep your back on the mat. And we have six seconds left. We are almost done here. And up. So we're back into drop lunges. And go. So this is our second to last round, guys. We're almost finished. <laughs> almost done. Which is awesome. Always. <laughs> Nothing feels better than being finished with an awesome little workout. Got eight seconds left here. And then we're going into scissors. And three, two, last one, and scissor time. So roll on down and go. And switch. And switch. You're just nice. Take your time for a second on the switches. Keep that low back pressed to the mat. Belly button engaged and pulling back to your spine. And we're done in three seconds. Last one and up. So we're going into in and out squats right now. Ooh, <laughs> I will be so happy when the last one of these is done. <laughs> As I'm sure you will too. So last 13 seconds. Oh my. <laughs> Push through the burn, wherever you're feeling it, and three, and two, and done. All right, legs up, twist. All right, and go. So twisting to that opposite foot on the outside, making sure not to crane your neck, keeping your legs as straight as you can. All these pointers. <laughs> Six seconds left. My legs are bending a little because of the quad burn. All right, end up. We're going into those sumo jacks right now. All right. After this little set of two, we will be on the very last round. <laughs> Yay. Anyone else excited? <laughs> I hope so. I hope it's not just me. All right, 10 seconds left of sumo squats. Whew. And five. And then we're going into those double dead bugs. And here we go. Double dead bugs and go. So try your best to keep your knees at 90. I know your quads are tired. <laughs> your legs are tired. And you might be a little out of breath like me. Almost done though. We're almost on to the very last round. In three seconds. And up. So, last time for everything here. And drop lunges. Last time doing these. Yay! I can see the shadow of my hair. It looks nuts. <laughs> and 12 seconds left. Keep on dropping and lunging. You're doing great. And five, almost done. And up and into scissors. Legs up and go. Last time for these. So get your legs as straight as you can. Last scissors. Really focus on engaging your core. Because we're almost done. Almost finished. And we have six seconds left here. I seem to look at six seconds every time. <laughs> and done. All right, so we're going into those in and out squats right now. Last time, we're almost done. Almost finished here. This is the last set of these. So really just push through. I know your legs are burning. Mine are burning. <laughs> and almost done. Two, one, 
All right, so legs up with a twist. So legs straight up and go. Get them as straight as you can because we're almost done. Nice little twists and reaches. We're almost done here. And then we're on to our last two moves in five seconds. And up. So we're going to those sumo squats or sumo jacks. And let's go. All right. You can make it through these for the last time. I know you can. If I can, then you can. Whew. Nice sumo squats. And then we're going to dead bugs. We're almost done. And three, and two, and dead bug time. All right, so let's go. This is it. We're finishing, finishing on the dead bugs. My legs feel not as dead <laughs> as a dead bug. But that's good. What else does it work out for, right? <laughs> We're almost done. We have five seconds left, and that's it. We did six full rounds. You guys are killing it. Killing the workout. I know you are. And finished. All right. I even let you do three seconds extra. <laughs> so, good job. <laughs> um, that was a great little workout, about 18 minutes of legs and abs. <laughs> uh, so, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it got you sweaty, out of breath. I hope you felt it. Um, and I hope you will come back and do it again. Uh, yeah, I'm a little tired, so my talking afterwards isn't going that well. But thank you for joining me. I'm so glad you did. And I'll see you next time.